breaking the wall of tumor ablation. Ladies Ji Xuan, Leibniz Institute for Plasma Science and Technology, Greifswald. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm very glad to present you an innovative technology contributing to our battle with cancer. Every year, more than 8 million people's lives are taken away by cancer, a malignant tumor. Even worse news, even worse news is that the number of patients is increasing rapidly, especially in developed countries. For most tumor patients with a solid tumor, the best chance of a cure is to cut the tumor off. Unfortunately, a lot of patients are not eligible for surgical reaction. To overcome this limitation, many tumor ablation methods have been developed. Heat, cold, chemicals, and radiation are all used to ablate tumor. They are very helpful, but they still have many issues, such as non-selective damage and high re recurrence rate. So in short, new technologies for tumor ablation is needed. So our technology is nanosecond pulsed electric field. It features very short pulse duration and a very strong electric field. The principle of using nanosecond pulses for tumor ablation is very straightforward. By sending the electrodes to the tumor, nanosecond pulses can selectively damage cell membrane and organelle membranes, inducing apoptosis of tumor cells. Apoptosis is a programmed cell death, so the immune system will recognize these apoptotic cells and eat them. This is a better ablation method. It's non-thermal, non-ionizing, and very accurate. We are dedicated to the development of this technology from an idea to a medical device. And here you see a prototype of our pulse generator for animal experiment. A pulse generator and a needle electrode. This picture shows you a mouse implanted with a liver tumor. Three days after treatment with nanosecond pulses, the tumor is completely gone. And with a new developed prototype, next January, we will treat liver tumors on large animals. Ladies and gentlemen, we believe this technology in the next five to 10 years will break the wall of tumor ablation. Thank you. How do you avoid killing normal cells and selectively killing tumors? Well, actually, this is a physical therapy, so we kill everything within the treatment area. <laughs> it's ablation. Any experience uh, regarding recurrence? Uh, so far, no.